everybody, I'm Ernie Hatmaker and I'm standing just in front of the uh, the corn patch. It's actually the Three Sisters patch and the sunflowers are doing pretty well, if you can see that. But I want to show you the difference between the two types of corn I've got. On this side, the shorter corn is sweet corn. It's like a, I think it's a bantam. I think I got it, uh, Better Homes and Gardens bantam corn, something I bought at Walmart. And it had early tassels, and there's only a few small, small places where there's silk coming out. But it's just been the stress of the intense heat, and then the sporadic rain and you know you get three four inches in an hour and then for the next week there's nothing so you can even see where there's a couple of you know purple tassels in there where you could tell that it got um fertilized a little bit late but anyway the trucker's favorite over here um, it's actually just starting to tassel, whereas the sweet corn tasseled, I don't know, over two weeks ago. And there's still, you know, lots of little flaky flakes. Hey, look at that. Look at that stink bug right there trying to hide. You see him trying to hide from me? That one's not hiding. No, this is not the wild animal food plot. And if I see stink bugs, I remove them, and they are never seen again. So, bye-bye to that guy and his friend. But anyway, um, something I did not plant is bindweed. Look at it. It's climbing up this sunflower, and that's what they do. And you have to get rid of all the bindweed. So anyway, yeah, the trucker's favorite is a little bit more hardy and can withstand a little bit more uh, pressure, I guess, as far as, like, the environment goes than the other. It's, it's drought tolerant. What in the world? What is that creature? That is a... I don't even know. Is that a spider? I'm kind of scared to go up there. Look at those ears though. Woo!